Okay, so you've all heard about Higgs boson, but what exactly is all the fuss about? We'll explain. Remember this guy? He said everything in space, like you or the chair you're sitting in, has mass. Mass represents the amount of particles in an object. The more mass, the heavier it is. But in the 60s, Peter Higgs noticed that particles don't have volume. They appear empty. So how can they have mass? He said mass is not stuff, but something like a charge. The charge is given to the particles by an invisible field that is all around us, the Higgs field. Some particles react strongly to it and are given a lot of mass. Other particles are hardly affected by it and get little or no mass at all. Mass causes particles to be attracted to each other, thus forming objects, creating life. Without the Higgs field, there would be no mass and every particle would fly around at the speed of light. There would be, well, uh, nothing. Higgs theory became a foundation for modern physics. Others used his ideas to create more and more theories. Only problem, the Higgs field was never proven. And if it was incorrect, it could shatter everything we thought we knew about physics. So how can the Higgs field be proven? Well, you need to collide two particles and study the decay and see if it contains part of the Higgs field, called a Higgs boson. But a massive amount of force and some super quick measuring instruments are needed. For that reason, CERN created the impressive LHC near Geneva. The LHC has the power and observatory capabilities to discover a Higgs boson. And recently, that's what scientists at CERN think they found. The discovery could lead to a confirmation of our understandings in physics, or provide us with a clean slate, ready to be filled with brand new insights of the universe. One thing's for sure, exciting times are ahead. For the people at CERN, for science, and for you and me. Thank you, Mr. Higgs.